What's going on guys? My name is Sub Pretty Kid and welcome to episode 5 of Black Ops 3 Zombies Tips and Tricks. So today I'm connecting you guys with a very simple trick that will teach you how you can reuse your Mega Gobble Gums. Now as the title says, you guys can be using this trick to get an infinite amount of a set Gobble Gum. So let's say you only have time to play maybe an hour or two a day and you don't want to waste COD points to get Liquid Diviniums and you know you don't really want to grind out you know a one hour game to get two Liquid Diviniums only. Uh, let's say you don't want to do that and let's say you have like a perkaholic or a wall power just one of them and you don't really want to waste it but you do want to use it you know you don't know what to do well this is very useful because with this trick you guys can go into a game you can use it you can do the trick and then once the game ends you will still have your mega gobble gum also this trick is really useful to do the challenges in zombies that require you to use mega gobble gums like there's a wall power challenge that you have to use 15 wall powers to get a calling card well if you have terrible luck and don't get too many wall powers like me then you could use this and effectively reuse your one wall power and then the game will still count it as you used it you know 15 times and you could still get your calling card but anyways I'm getting ahead of myself so first of all I need to show you guys how to actually do this now if you guys look at the gameplay on your screen before I go into a game before I find the game I'm actually showing you guys how many perkaholics I have in my mega gobble gum pack and obviously I have three of them now at this point, I'm just gonna fast forward the gameplay for the reason being that I didn't want anyone to think that the video was fake, that I was doing some fancy editing skills so you guys could think I'm showing you guys some fake trick just for the lols. No, I'm not doing that. You guys will see why you might think that afterwards. But for the time being, I'm just gonna fast forward rather than, you know, just skip into the next gameplay. But anyways, after like an hour of matchmaking, I finally find a match. You guys can see I pulled up the scoreboard right about now, I believe, and I'm playing with these fine gentlemen. So just remember the names because I will pull up the scoreboard again after I do the trick just so you guys know that there were no shenanigans done in this video. But anyways, I do eventually get Perkaholic, and once I do, I do play around with it for a bit because it is pretty fun to play around with seven perks. Come on, guys, you know, it should be fun. But anyways, after that, I end up leaving the game. Now, that is the key to doing this. Leaving the game is what makes this whole thing work. Why? I don't know. I feel like it's not patchable, though. This is obviously a glitch, but I feel like it's one of those glitches that cannot be patched, like the barrier glitches back in Black Ops 1. So anyways, before I leave the game, you guys can see that I do pull up the scoreboard again just so you guys can be assured that there were no shenanigans in this video. Now, after I fast forward to the Frozen Forest part, hopefully it fast forwards now, I go to the Gobble Gum menu and you guys can clearly see that I still have three Perkaholics. But anyways, guys, that's how you do the trick. Hopefully you guys find it as enjoyable and as useful as I did because like I said before, those challenges that require like 15 wall powers, ain't nobody got time for that, guys. Ain't nobody got time for that. But anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to drop a like down below, subscribe for more zombies videos, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.